Hello again, everyone. This is Tim Buell for Notebooks.com, and I'm back today with another Mac video tutorial. Today's topic is how to check for and remove Mac malware. Now, if you've been a Mac user for a while, you probably haven't encountered too many viruses or any malware of the sort. However, because the Macs are becoming more prevalent, this is something that you might see. Fortunately, there is a great application called Malware Bytes, which is available free to download for any Mac user that might be suspicious of malware currently on your device. Now, Malware Bytes is a quick, easy run, and it has a light footprint, so you don't have to worry about installing anything huge. And this is something that you can usually download and run within three to five minutes. Ways that you might recognize that you currently are infected with malware is if you're using Safari or Firefox consistently getting pop-ups for third-party applications or your Google searches are going to an incorrect place usually is an indication that you have some sort of malware infection on the computer and fortunately an installation of malware bytes or if you just want to run it from the disk image will go ahead and take care of that within just a few minutes as I mentioned the program does have a very small footprint so if you do want to install it to your hard drive you don't have to worry about taking up a lot of space but once you get the application open go ahead and click the magnifying glass to begin your scan of your hard drive and malware Malwarebytes will begin its search for any infected files on your computer. As mentioned, it's a very quick process, only about three minutes or less in my experience, and it will usually let you know if it was able to find any malware programs and if it was able to delete them. It also includes a handy link in case it was not able to resolve your malware issues, and if you click that, it will go back to the Malwarebytes website where it will have further information on what to do if your malware infected computer was not able to be fixed by their piece of software. In my experience, this has gotten all of the malware off of computers, at least I'd say 99% of the time in my experience, and all of the computers I have seen with further infections have been able to quickly get remedied by using this application. Malware is definitely something Mac users have not had to worry about as much in the past, but in today's day and age, it's definitely something to keep an eye out for, especially if you notice suspicious behavior while using Safari or Firefox. Hope you found this helpful, and take care.